Welcome to Healthy Chit Chat with Coach Shalynn, the podcast where we unlock health secrets so that you can live your life to the fullest and walk out your life's purpose. Hello, everyone. It's Coach Shalynn, and welcome to Healthy Chit Chat. And I'm so excited to spend time with you today. So the premise of actually Healthy Chit Chat with Coach Shalynn is to talk all about health and wellness and all of the things that can really inspire you to move forward to have that well-rounded health approach. So I am just not the coach that only works with the food that's on your plate, <laughs> Because health and wellness is so much more than that. It includes how we feel about ourselves. It includes how we move every day. It includes even our hobbies. And so today, I actually wanted to pull back in a different approach and just tell you a little bit about the hobbies that I have. So the main hobby that I have is knitting. So I actually have my favorite well, I'll say one of my favorite knitting books. And knitting for me really helped to put me in a different frame of mind. I learned all about slowing down. I learned about being patient. I learned about being able to read a pattern and be able to translate that into a finished item. And just beyond that, I learned so much more about myself because I am a self-taught knitter. I taught myself how to knit, which is so cool. And there's something about having crafts and being able to do things with your hands. It's just that hand and eye coordination that brings so many things together. And so you may say, Coach Lynn, if this is a health and wellness type of podcast, why are you talking about knitting And why are you telling us about your favorite book? (laughs) What does that have to do with how you really move forward in your health and wellness journey? I'm so glad you asked that question. Because when it comes to actually health and wellness and moving forward with your goals, friend, you cannot rush. You have to take your time. And the funny thing about like uh, how I work with women and how I work to work in my group coaching sessions, I always talk about how I am not a microwave coach. I do not rush. I'm not the type of coach where you put a bag of popcorn in the microwave, hit the button, and the popcorn is done. I like to be able to take the time that is necessary to really slow down, to really question, you know, why are you in this place? What has transpired? And what can you really do in more of a lifestyle to really keep you going. And this podcast is not about me. It's all about you. I want you to find hobbies that really can connect in your everyday lifestyle to help you connect in how you are walking every day in your health and wellness goals. And when you put the two together, everything changes for the better. So what's the biggest thing that you can do to find out what hobbies work for you? Well, maybe go back to middle school or go back to high school and think about what did you enjoy during that time more. Think about what types of newer hobbies did did you maybe learn and maybe you didn't move forward in those hobbies. Or think about what do you do when you have five minutes for yourself? Is it reading a book? Is it taking a walk outside? Is it calling up a friend to offer encouragement to someone? Is it writing in a journal? Whatever those hobbies are, just take the time and add those into your everyday health and wellness journey as well as your lifestyle and you will see a huge difference in your mindset. So that's all I have for you today. I'll talk to you soon. Bye for now. Well, you've reached the end of another fantastic episode of Healthy Chit Chat with Coach Shalyn. Thank you for joining us. For show notes and resources, visit www.healthcoachshalyn.com and click on the Healthy Chit Chat with Coach Shalyn page. We know you love this episode, so be sure to subscribe rate and leave a review on iTunes, Spotify, and Google Podcasts. 
Until next time, remember, you can live life with energy and vitality, and we are here to help you do just that.